What's up, Salmon Squad? I am the game Salmon, and welcome to to SpongeBob. I think this game is called SpongeBob of Terror, or it's possibly called SpongeBob Horror Project. I don't really know. The game doesn't really have a title, so I think I'll go with SpongeBob of Terror. This is a horror game that I stumbled upon that I was going to throw it into a three random SpongeBob games type video, but I felt that this game could have enough in it to be its own video. All right, I think that's all that I have to say. Patrick, what do you got for me? Finland! Okay, if you're excited for SpongeBob to scare the crap out of me, please be sure to like the video, subscribe, go follow me on Twitch, and leave a comment down below. Hello? Are we coming to... in SpongeBob's house? Wait, am I playing as SpongeBob? I thought we were going to be chased by SpongeBob. I think. Right? Agara El Encindador. Lighter? Encindador is lighter, I think. Pulsa... Uh, click. Oh, click to use? Or... Oh, got it! Got it! Okay. So, click to use the lighter. Um, something about a monitor. Right? Oh, is this how I see where he is? Okay, I guess we'll start exploring now. Control to crouch. Space to jump. E and Q to look around. I'm sorry, can I not leave? Oh, do I go this way? Oh, my bad. Alright, let's... <gasps> oh, that was loud! Okay, we're in the living room. Can I... SpongeBob! SpongeBob, no! SpongeBob, no! Okay. W what's the objective here? There's a nice friendly picture of SpongeBob and Squidward. Um, is SpongeBob in the kitchen? Do you still chase after me? Or are we okay? This is how I can tell where you are in the monitor. I get that. You're walking back to the kitchen. Gosh, I'm not sure what I need to do. Quite honestly, I don't know if I can outrun him either. I can't just leave. I need a code. I need to find a code. Got it. Okay. Got to find the code for SpongeBob. <laughs> oh, 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 SpongeBob. Oh, God. Oh, wee woo, man. Wee woo. It looks like the only place that I'm able to go next is the kitchen. That SpongeBob seems to enjoy spending all of his time in, and his back is turned. I made it to the bathroom. I'm not sure what the game wants me to do. Maybe I have to wait till he goes into the bathroom? Okay, so that's how I save my game. Not that I've done anything that requires saving yet. <gasps> oh my god! His house is too small to, to make a horror game. Okay, you're walking in the kitchen. I am going to check your closet. Can I run? Yeah, I can run and you don't care. I need a key card from my inventory. Do I have an inventory? How do I activate the inventory? SpongeBob? 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 I think I broke SpongeBob. Just gonna throw that out there. Oh, hello there. I'm not finding anything of substance in the bathroom. So now we need to see if we truly broke the game and get in front of SpongeBob and search the kitchen. Oh, I didn't break the game. I still broke the game, but he could still see me. Okay. <laughs> well, it was worth a shot. 
Maybe I have to do that. And now I have to wait for him to go into the living room, and then I can explore the kitchen. Relatively unscathed, except he might actually go to the bathroom next. <gasps> it was a good plan, okay? It was a good plan until I died. Okay. Go to the bathroom. You're in the bathroom. I'm gonna run by ya. And I'm gonna crouch. And I'm not seeing anything in the kitchen. I thought there'd be something over here. But I am wrong. Go into the living room. Really? Are you serious? You are dumb. SpongeBob. What the heck? How do I beat your game? Okay. Guys, there's nothing in the kitchen. I don't know what I need to be grabbing. And of course, I found this little exploit here that I can just wait here for a sec and then just do this. And then he just walks away. <laughs> All right. Does that count as breaking the game? Really? Are you serious? For the record, the only reason I knew where to find that was because Luigi Kid played this game and he found that location. So props to Luigi Kid for finding something this small in a horror game that that's dumb. That is that is such a dumb location for a key. Well, is this a key or is this a key card? No. It's just a key. So where do I use the key? Oh. Okay. Well, that's good to know. <gasps> okay, the drawer has been unlocked. One. Okay. So, I guess I have to find... Three more pieces of paper? That'll give me the code? These pieces of paper might be annoying to find. Especially if Spongebob is gonna be a big old butt about all this. <gasps> God, Spongebob! Come on! You know, I've had enough of you at this point. Oh God, is he stuck again? Spongebob, come on! Oh, what, oh, what, oh, wait. I got another key. Okay. SpongeBob, you stay there. This isn't a key card, right? Yeah, there's no key card in my inventory, which means I probably have to open up another drawer, right? Two. Okay. Save my game. Another key, let's go! No, not that one. But maybe this one? Aha! Oh, key card! Oh, sweet! Okay, cool. So now, while SpongeBob is still broken, I can unlock this. <laughs> okay, that's a high-tech door. Okay, there's gotta be one in here. Whoa, whoa, stop it, stop, stop freaking out. I just thought I could like jump over. Never mind. I guess that's something that the game doesn't want me to do. Okay, fine. Stop freaking out for me, please, and just give me a key. Wait, 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 wait. Zero. Okay. All right, so what were the numbers again? One, two, zero. Oh, we're still missing one. Wait, wait, wait. No, I still need to find a key. Actually, I probably don't even need a key because I can just start guessing. Maybe? Oh, the game doesn't like me typing in wrong numbers and that's supposed to alert SpongeBob, but I broke SpongeBob! The last key has got to be in the kitchen, because I have one more drawer to open. 
Now, even if we find the last key and get, like, that one final number that we need to unlock the door, I don't know what order the combination is in. Let's go. Let's go. It was in the sink. It was in the kitchen sink. It was in the kitchen sink. To the kitchen sink. Am I okay? Oh my god. Okay. All right. Save the game. I think it was this one, right? Yes. All right. Number five. Now we just have to figure out what order these are supposed to go in. The easiest way to do this would be to break SpongeBob so I have like unlimited chances to try to escape. Um, I don't exactly know how I broke him, but, uh, can't be too hard for me, can it? <gasps> got it, got it, got it! I'm out, I'm out, I'm out! Gracias por jugar, thank you for playing. <laughs> Let's go! Alright, what to say about this game? Um... It was a little annoying to even figure out, and I think that's kind of because my Spanish is super rusty, and the game just kind of threw a whole bunch of Spanish at me, and maybe within there it said to go pick up four keys, but, um, <laughs> I, I, either way, those keys were really small. It would have really helped if they, like, shimmered or something. Um, to give me at least a little bit of a clue that, oh, I should probably go over here, or, oh, there's something hidden over here that I need to outwit Spongebob for. Um, but even then, I mean, Spongebob attacked me a lot. And that's kind of because, I said this before, Spongebob's house is not a good location for a horror level. Around the Clock did it probably the best way you could, but even that level I had, you know, issues, right? But... I mean, what can you do? I think that's all I have to say. Props to the dev for creating a somewhat accurate feel for uh, SpongeBob's kitchen and living room and bedroom. But yeah, that's that's all that I got for you today. Uh, I'm sure more SpongeBob content is going to be on the way. I did find more SpongeBob stuff, but I might throw them into like, oh, a three random game type of thing. I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna do. But that's gonna be it for me. Thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end cards at the end of this video. Like and subscribe if you have not already done so. I love you all so much. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy, stay happy. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.